Greetings, Pokey fans! Michael here, and welcome to the newest episode of my Pokemon Quest playthrough. If you haven't enjoyed the series, don't forget to drop a like on the video. Uh, shows me that you want to see more of this series that I am thoroughly enjoying, so even if you don't want to see it, I'm probably going to keep doing it. Um, I am by myself this episode because today is Sunday as I'm recording this, and John is going to see his sister for her birthday. And is unavailable and I wanted to keep recording and he told me it was fine if I recorded by myself so because I want to keep playing that's what I'm doing so I did a little bit of stuff off camera between the end of last episode and this episode um, I did several so the first thing you'll notice my team is now Parasect, Farfetch'd, and Butterfree I the high level Paris and Caterpie I had I was like I want to try and level them up and see how good they are and I leveled them up, I evolved them, and now you can see my number is 5747. If we go to Expeditions, the boss for the bug boosted area is 5700. But with the bug boost, I'm above that, and I'm up to 7500, assuming that's correct math. So, we're sizably above it now, which we were not before. I'm planning to attempt this boss first thing. Because this boss, uh, once you beat it, we get access to the silver pot, which makes makes it so we can get even better Pokemon than what we currently have. Um, but before we do that, I want to open all these pots that I cooked um, and see what we get. Alright. Bug-type Pokemon. Maybe we'll get something. Okay, another Paris. I wonder if it's going to be better than the one I already have. It's level 30, it knows. Light screen? No, it is not better than the one I currently have. Um, I can maybe use it to change my current one's move. It knows Leech Seed, which isn't the best, but it's also not horrible because it heals it. Grayish Pokemon, okay. An Oddish. Oddish is grayish? Oddish is definitely blue. What do you know? Is that Stun Spore? Yeah. Um, okay. <laughs> Alright, two more pots. We'll do this one. Yellowish Pokemon. I, like, couldn't remember what I cooked at all. <laughs> a Bell Sprout. Alright, that's a new Pokemon. What do you know? Synthesis. Synthesis raises damage? It doesn't heal? That's weird. And Bullet Seed. Okay. Unfortunately, that's probably not going to be that useful. Um, oh, a Pokemon. Oh, that's right. My Pokemon for today showed up, and it's another Paris. <laughs> I'm getting so many of these. Well, 25? What does it know? It knows Leech Seed and Light Screen. Oh, that might actually be better than my current one. Because light screen with a sharing stone? It's going to be more offensive, unfortunately. Because I could probably level it up to get that last thing. What's my current one? No. So he's got five. With two hearts. I'm kind of tempted to try that Paris that showed up in my, my place instead of the Parasect because Light Screen with a Sharing Stone could be really helpful because I don't use Leech Seed that often. Ground type Pokemon. Oh, this might have been like a really good one. Cubone! It's my first one of those. What's up, Cubone? You might come in handy later. It's my level 16? What? Bone Meringue. Sandstorm. Okay, it's got two different attacks. All right. Nothing super exciting, but whatever. Um, let's look at this other Paris. This one. What did this one know? This one only knows light screen, right? 
Yeah, that one only knows light screen, so I definitely don't want to use that one. Because I want to be able to do damage in a pinch if, if need be. And what level does it evolve? Because that, I might have to keep that in mind. What level does Paris evolve? 24, okay, so I could evolve it. Okay, well, I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna try this, uh, I think I'm gonna try this, this Paris with light screen and it could be a little bit more offensive. Well, light screen doesn't raise defense. Light screen just, that's right. I thought light screen raised defense. It just resists effects. Well, that might be handy. I'm not wasting anything if I train it. Because I'm not going to get rid of my current Parasect. Move learning. Yeah. Just want to make sure those were the correct moves. 28. Alright. Well, let's just go for it. Okay. Because the effects might be helpful for this bug area, you know what I mean? But part of me is like concerned that it has too little HP, you know? Only 230? What does this one have? 700. Okay, well this one doesn't have any boosts, but like... Nah, I feel like I should stick with my current one, because I need something that's not going to be super frail. You know? All right, well, let's cook like just a small dish, you know? Uh, let's just do like the psychic one because I know I'm gonna need like psychic Pokemon later. This is just to see if we get like a shiny, but I wanna save my other ingredients for once I get the silver pot, which I'm pretty confident I'm gonna be able to, to do right now. I'm just gonna go with what I had. I thought about that too long. <laughs> All right, guys, let's see if we can beat this boss. We're 1,800 over. So, just got to make sure if we, like, run into any exploding things, we get away from those. Okay. So far, so good. I'm kind of nervous. Butterfree moves fast. <laughs> ah, I wasted that sky attack. Oh man, I wasted that sky attack too. Let's evade. I wasted that leech seed as well. Oops. <laughs> Alright, here's the boss. Alakazam! He's already dead. Okay, but we're down to just Alakazam, which is nice. Oh, we did it! Yes! All right! Oh, man. Having boosted types is so important. <laughs> oh boy. Guys, we get the silver pot now. <laughs> we can cook amazing creatures. I know what I'm cooking immediately. 
Oh, whoa, that Tangela statue's crazy! What is this boost experience now? Chamber of Legends in includes incredibly awesome loot. Well, that is unsurprising. <laughs> Alright, so that's the rock boosted area. 6100's the lowest? Alright, we're gonna have to just grind for materials for a while, I think. Just because, like, we, we're, we're not, we can't even beat the lowest one. We gotta go cook, like, we gotta cook some silver pots for ground and rock types. Um, what quest did I get? Oh, the silver. That's right. Alright, let's cook some things in the silver pots. Is the challenge I got? Grass type. Recipe collector, don't want to use the battery recharge yet. Okay, back to base! Back to base camp. Let's cook some delicious meals. Okay. Alright, switch to the silver pot. Alright, I want to do the ground one first. There's a three-star ground one that is... Three... Oh, I don't have enough for it. Oh, that's right, it's 15 each. Crap. <laughs> I was like, oh yeah, I got 30. It's plenty. No, it's... Balls. I need so many of these. <laughs> no! That's unfortunate. Okay, you know what? It's fine. We'll start cooking a... Super high star... Psychic one, because I know I'll need that. That is the psychic one, right? Yes, it is. Well, looks like I gotta save up more honey than I th thought I did. I've gotten so much honey and that still wasn't enough. <laughs> what? Why? Why are you like this game? Why do you require... Because... There's two different three-star ground dishes. Three honeys, two ice rocks, or three big roots and two ice rocks, which means I need 45 honeys and 30 ice rocks. I have the ice rocks. I have over, I have exactly 30, but I need more honeys or more red things. Um, so we gotta go, we gotta go do that. Should we get the honeys? Yeah, we should get the honeys, because honeys are going to be good for electric as well. So, should we just do the boss again? Like, Because this has the highest yellow. It's got large yellow and red yields, which is actually exactly what I want. Let's just do the boss again. Like, we, I can, we saw that I beat it. Like, yeah, Butterfree went down, but like... That was fine. Okay. That's pretty satisfying, I'm not gonna lie. The lunge when it just, like, kills everything in the vicinity. Ah, that's unfortunate. Stall out the defense drops, no!
Booyah! Man, I'm gonna miss Farfetch'd. Cause like, as we level up, did I get any honey from that at all? Cause like, as we level up, you know, like it, it's, I've gotten to the point in the game where it's essentially like, I need to attract Pokemon using the silver pots. I didn't get a single honey? I got 54 acorns, but I need honey. Ugh. All right, well, let's go open our pot at the very least. Come on. <laughs> All right, Psychic. Abra, which is unsurprising because those are like the only things that come from the Psychic pots. Not shiny. How dare you? All right. <sighs> okay, well, can we cook like a worse rock dish at the very least? I definitely want to save the ice rocks for something really good. Oh, I can do this. This is a rock dish. It's not fantastic, it's kind of like just basic, but at the very least it should give me a high level Pokemon that I can uh, use to train others. Oh, it's actually, since I've got so many block berries, I think it's actually better if I do this. Because it says one red mushroom, two block berries, and two fossils. I'm just gonna do the same thing. I should probably save those fossils, actually. <laughs> Man, all electric dishes need honey, and that is just so unfair. <laughs> Why do you need so much honey? Why are you like this? Are there any, like, rock dishes that... I need to save those fossils. Ugh. All right, I should probably, should probably stop. Give me honey, you silly game. I'm gonna do this one more time. If it doesn't give me any honey, I'm gonna try a different thing in that area. <laughs> I got honey! Let's go! That's good. Need that honey. Oh, we need to kill that hypno fast. Oh, alright. Well, killed it before Farfetch got to do anything. <laughs> Hypnos are a giant pain because they put you to sleep and disable your moves, and it's just awful. I love just okoing the Abras. Kadabura. Got rainbow things. Oh, I forgot I had those. I suppose I could use some of those. Dang it, Parasect, you got in the way. <laughs> Dang it, that missed. I can't even see everybody. Where is Butterfree? Oh. Alright, we wrecked it. <laughs> How much honey did I get? Did I get enough to make that ground dish? You're just giving me acorns and blueberries! Those are the last things I need! <laughs> I have so many of those! I got six honeys. Okay, that might be enough. That might be enough. If 
Please tell me that's enough. Forty-three. Oh my god, that's so frustrating. <laughs> Why? Why? Just give me the freaking... <sighs> what quest did I get? Maybe I got a quest that gives me some honey or some big roots. Nope. It's just... Is there one? Poison type buddies, ground type buddies. Wait a second. There's achievements. Fire type team, or electric type team, or ground type team. I can just make a team and do an easy run. I forgot about those. Jubilee showed me those last night. Okay. Uh, the ground type one is one I know I can do. Is Rhyhorn a... Okay, that's three close range. We don't want that. I keep thinking that Scyther is Tyranitar. Right here, its face looks like Tyranitar's and it throws me off. Okay, we're weak, but I don't care. I just have to do, like, one run of, like, an easy level. So I can get the achievement for ground and rock type team. Because they're all rock ground. Okay, we're 2100. There's lots of yellow drops there, so I could get more honey from there. So the blue drops there. I know I'll need the ice rock. Just go for this one. I didn't give him any stones or anything. So, that's why I'm doing a weak one. I didn't want to mess with the stones. Crunch. How good is that? Oh, that did quite a bit. Rhyhorn's already at half health. <laughs> All right. Rhyhorn's dying, but the other two are totally healthy, so... Taking a long time to walk to this next wave. Just one Psyduck? Oh. Okay, mini boss, gold duck. I was a little bit worried there for a bit, minute, but it was fine. 
<laughs> I bet I got like no icy rocks from that. Bold predictions. I was right. I didn't get a single icy rock. This is the blue boosted area. So annoying. Okay. But that should give us the quest result, like rewards. Gave me the big root. Which ground type team. There we go. So now I can make the ground type dish. Which is 45 big roots and 30 ice rocks. Oh, this one's open. Okay, well, let's see what we got. I think it was just like a psychic type. Yeah, it's probably just going to be a buff Abra. Look at that. The psychic type dish brought an Abra. Big surprise. Level 67. <laughs> That's why you get the silver thing, guys. It, no it doesn't even know an attack. It's got only attacking squares. Did you see that? It's got no... That is a... It's got attacking squares, but no HP squares. That's unfortunate. Okay. All right. Three big roots. Two icy rocks. Silver pot. Let's go. Seven! Whoa, that's the largest number I've seen. Okay, well, I guess we're gonna have to wait till next episode to do more of that. Oh my god. Oh wait. Which areas I wanna I wanna just I need to grind in the area that has the like most like blue and yellow ingredients. Is that these planes? That's red and yellow. This is blue and gray. This is red and gray. This is blue and yellow. Guess we might as well just do the boss there. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what else I'm gonna do. Okay, well, there's a solid chance I'm gonna end up continuing to use this Graveler. Probably not the Rhyhorn. Rhyhorn's pretty frail. Definitely want Farfetch back on the team. And we'll toss Lapras back on the team. We'll go back to the the pre-bug squad for now. I gotta give him power charms. Um, I can give you this better one. Oh, Jubilee. Jubilee was telling me that hit healing is like a really OP boost. It's like critical hit damage. She said if you get any stones that have hit healing, like do not trash them. Like no matter how low they are. I've yet to see one that has hit healing. I see natural HP healing, but there's hit healing, which is where if you hit your Pokemon. I don't even think I have any. I don't think I have one. I do not have any hit healing stones, which is a large bummer but not a massive deal. Um, let's go to Graveler and give you lots of nice hearts. Excuse me. Actually, oh no, that's on Farfetch, never mind. Alright, what's the bingo bonus you get now, Mr. Graveler, sir? Attack of normal type moves gets a little bit stronger. Yeah, see, hit healing right here. Hit healing percentage, zero. Because I don't have any stones that have hit healing. If I ever get one, I need to make sure I don't ditch it. 
but I still got room for more stones, so we're just gonna we're gonna do some runs. We're up to fifty seven hundred. Yeah, I mean if we're just gonna we're just gonna do this area because it like it has the largest drops of blue and yellow, and those are really what I need. Uh, but let's just go for it. Probably just gonna be grinding these out for a little while because I'm I need stronger Pokemon and I don't have them. <laughs> Lots of honey from that. That was great. Okay, come on, fam. Oh, we got big roots, more ground types. Dang it, missed. Oh, well, we, we got him with a bit, but. This is kind of relaxing when it's just like not very strong, you know? You just kind of wreck everything. I could definitely leave this on auto, but like, I think it's good practice. It keeps my mind sharp, keeps my skills sharp. Oh, there's Polyrath. Hey, buddy. We need to kill you now. Absolutely decimated that Poliwag. Did I avoid that? I'm not sure if I did or not. Wrecked it, but we're also like twice the number of necessary points, so. Critical hit damage, no hit healing, but we got six honeys into, you get a single icy rock again? Come on. All right, well, let's go open our pot. I need so many icy rock guys. If I want to make strong ground and rock types, I need icy rocks. And I've got none. Favorite fruit of ground type Pokemon. Another Rhyhorn. I know this Rhyhorn's not as, not fantastic. It's level 46. Iron Tail and Roar, okay. So I can scatter the bad guys if things get sticky. All right, we'll keep it around. Um, I'm gonna make another rock type dish with just the tiny ingredients. So, two of these. Yeah, because I think this will help. Like, it'll get us a strong one we can use to, like, train others at the very least. Um, I guess let's keep going. I really need the Icy Rocks, though, so I think I might do, like, the Water Boosted area instead, because this is, like, it's got a lot of blue. And I'm going to need Fossils for Rock types, so let's just do this. Go for the stronger ones. The big maze here. This one's this one can be tricky to flee from things because there's so much uh because there's not much room, you know. Oh, lots of icy rocks. This was a good call. If 
if I get another ingredient that like increases like ingredient drops, I, I definitely want to get the uh, the gray one. Maybe the red one, but I'd say gray one's more important. Because like gray is used a lot for rock types and a little bit for electric. That was important. Getting lots of big ingredients from this one, which is great. I hate it when that happens. We got a gold one! Please have hit healing. Okay, I'm glad I didn't hit that last dig. <laughs> Sup, Golem? All right, we're, we backed him into a corner, which is good. fainted that stinks I'll be back in a second finish him. Yep, okay. I like it when you can back the bad guys into a corner. <laughs> Alright, what stones did I get? Got six icy rocks. Critical hit damage, critical hit damage, movement speed. Man, no hit healing? It's chill? It's fine, I'm not upset. I'm a little upset. What HP stones do you have? I'm gonna give you this one, because that's an improvement on that one for sure. What is this? HP upon recovery. Ah, that's useful. So anyone that can use this 276 one? Probably Graveler. He's got a lot of slots for... Oh, yeah. Oh, my. Yes. Most certainly. Was this increase? Natural HP healing? Ah, oh, we should definitely toss that on. I need to recycle some of these, though. Cycle that, get rid of those. Go to the next pit. There you go. Well, give us a big root. All right, guys. How close are my pots to finishing? I don't think they're very close. Yeah. All right. If we had, like, one that was one away, I'd do one more run. But for now, I think it's this is a good place to wrap up the episode grinding for ingredients so we can... <laughs> cook more silver pots <laughs> but guys thank you so much for watching this episode if you enjoyed it don't forget to drop a like make sure i was gonna say make sure to answer the comment question but there's no comment question in this series i've been trained
from other series. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you're excited for the next episode. I certainly am. And that is all I have for now. Until next time, big fans. Gotta catch them all.